Hello, I'm Dan with, Hi. with Haunt Collective. You are? I'm Ryan Moss Jop okay. from the Last Hope Live Action Roleplay. Awesome. Uh, so, what is going on right now? What are, what are we? <laughs> I think there's a nose picking. <laughs> so, so what, what's happening here right now? Right now, we have a couple warriors that are squaring off in live action roleplay combat. They're using weapons that are fiberglass and foam injected so they can strike each other uh, safely but still replicate a real fight. Um, not sure if there's an honor duel or a personal vendetta or grudge something, something's going on. <laughs> Draperies yes. get in the way, but yes. they're doing live action role play combat. All right, so I'm watching them get hit. How does one know when they're dead? I, how does how do you know what's happening when somebody gets injured? Like you know what I mean? Like like there's the got to be rules. Behind it. There's yeah. got to the be rules, rules to this. Yeah. And actually, that's a really important part of uh, live action role play. It's similar to playing a board game or a tabletop role playing game like Dungeons and Dragons. There's a set rule system that uh, the players are, are, are fighting by. And you, you'll notice that they're doing larger swings so that their opponents know that they've been struck. It's medium contact so that they, they know they've been hit but they're not hitting too hard. Um, but basically it's, uh, you know, the more, the more armor you wear, the more hit points you get, uh, you can last in combat a bit longer. But as they take damage over time, they're keeping track of that in their head. Um, and then eventually their wounds will, will stack up and they'll eventually be taken out of the fight. But just like any board game or tabletop game, there's a rule system that they're playing by. Okay. So what is that rule system right now that we're watching? Is it, I mean, so I know that I know enough to know that there's shields, there's level of chain mail, there's all those different yeah. levels. How does one, is there referees? Like how does one know or is it honor system? Uh, on, honestly, it's an honor system. Okay. A lot of the players in the game know that we can't really LARP without other people. It's a community-based social um, hobby, and playing by the rules is a really important part of that. So, you know, utilizing those rules, we're actually our own system. Uh, the last old live action role play system is the one that we made, and it dictates how many hit points you get, what kind of skills you can take as a character, the different things you can do, how to interact with the game, uh, and how many hit points or armor points you get from your equipment. So it really depends on them, what type of LARP you're playing and what their core rules are. I see. So is this a particular type or style of game that they're playing right now? Or is, like, what are the rules? How do you know how big or how small the teams are? Does it matter? Uh, well, is there honestly... one on 100? Is there <laughs> two versus two? Is there 100 versus 100? How... Like, what are the different style of games that you can watch? It honestly depends. We're, we're a live action role play, so wherever our story is going dictates what we're doing. Obviously, we're at a convention today, so it's a little bit more of like dueling fighting or one-on-one -on -one fights or two-on-two. -two. Got it. Um, but in the actual LARP, it is really based on what we're doing for the story. If if a noble is coming after a bunch of the players because they've angered him, he has a, his own armed forces, it might not be a fair fight. It might be something where they're up against the wall and they've, they've made somebody mad they shouldn't have made mad because the story has gone that way. And that's where a lot of that uh, kind of uh, that live action of reacting to the player's actions, the choices and consequences, kind of like that choose your own adventure that yep. keeps evolving based on what you do. I see. So it really is a live action. Absolutely. Perfect. Great timing. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs>